What's going on YouTube? This is Shadow of Death. Shadows of Death. It's a Call of Duty custom map. I came across this from a Twitter user, uh, CodFreak44. His name was Mike. And he posted a picture on Twitter, but basically showed it got to round five. And I thought, oh, cool. Another new map. Let's uh, try it out. And uh, unknown to him, I'm already a member of Zombie Modding, so I went and got loads of the um, downloads of the map. And uh, we've installed it. So, as usual, same rules apply. Haven't seen it, haven't tested it. Had a screenshot, but we've never played the map. And that's what we intend to do today. Let's go in the shadows and see what this map is all about. Ow. Where are we? Looks... Is it just one room? Is it just one room? Uh, we'll, we'll knife them for the moment. And then we'll have a quick nose around. Out of your depth, Don't want to get hit just yet. Because that would be a bit foolish to go down on round one. So we've made that. So all these perks. Oh, we need power. So let's put the power on. Okay, what's this? PP? Yep. And type 100. Mm. Okay. So I've got the box as well, so this is quite encouraging. Oh, they come through fast. Yeah. Let's just knife a, couple of, uh, a grenade, I should say. And let's grenade these and I'm just go and get some points and back up a bit. Might go and get the PP. Oh, that would have been embarrassing. Let's take care of that. Get some points. And uh, we will. We're going to get the PP, get some points. So, and it looks like this is just simply a, a challenge map. Maybe. Let's go and get the PP. We do like the PP. This is a points building exercise, which is quite nice. Oh, they're coming through already. So. And then I think we will, after this, get Jug. Oh, they just... So they don't even spawn in. They just literally pop up. Just pop up. Ah, there you go. You're taken care of. Nice thing about zombies is that they are easy to put down on the easier rounds. And to be truthful with you, the PP is actually an awesome gun. Oh, yeah, but he got 10 points. No matter. Yeah, so so they're not spawning. I wonder if they're going to come in the ground at a later level. We will have a look. No doubt. Please don't. If it's just the windows, I can think of a strategy that's going to work straight away. To be honest. Depends if they are the Vrut type zombies or whether they are just literally standard Nazi ones. They're going to start going hysterically insane. Is in running. I don't know. Let's take care of these. So we're building up some. We're getting some nice points now. I have to get some ammo in a minute. Ah, let's hit the box. Let's go for the box. Get some ammo. What have we got? Mm, okay, Magnum be right. Go ahead, zombie. Make my day. Not very good, are you? Oh, that's a bit of a cheat, isn't it? They just come through. Oh, don't, 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 don't go down yet. Run insta kill, so that's handy. Still come through. Ooh. So, as it stands, I might try and get a crawl or something, but it looks like we are simply in. A one room, one room challenge maybe. With two windows. I did do a challenge uh, room the other day. Knife them. Knife and knife and knife and knife. The trouble with the knifing on World at War is that it does get a bit dodgy, depending on how you uh, play the game. It also depends on the the, uh, the zombies themselves. Sometimes I just find that. You, 
I'm knifing them, but you're just being hit. It's a difficult, difficult one. I'd say to try and knife them as much as you can, but the knifing just seems to be a bit more poorer. Oh, max ammo, that do me. I love max ammo! Okay, so far, not bad. I mean, just the windows. They're coming through. So my strategy might work. I wonder if we've got monkeys on these maps. Because that would help. <gasps> monkeys! I don't believe it, I don't believe it, I don't believe it. We've got monkeys. And I was only just talking about them. I, I Honestly, guys, I have no clue. And I'm not a jinx. Um, you know, if I say the word monkeys, that they're going to suddenly appear. That was just pure bloody luck. Unless that box contains just monkeys, which it doesn't, because we've got the magnum. Um, we will try and do a points build-up exercise now. Let's see what we can gain. Do this window up. See if we can take care of these guys. Yeah. Let's get them. I'll get the kaboom. Again, I only got it for double points. Double points, double the fun, double the killing, double the pleasure of killing these zombies. Believe it or not, it's uh, school holidays start very, very shortly. And all I'm hearing at the moment is uh, the anticipation of Black Ops 3. Everyone's looking forward to Black Ops 3. It's amazing how game influences uh, children. And also adults as well, because I'm quite looking forward to it as well. Uh, right, let's get back to the game. Um, let's get a speed cola first. Oh, look. We could afford... Let's get this as well. I don't know if the quick revive will work or not. We will soon know. Still got the to kill, so that's handy. Got all about that. Thought we'd run out. Let's go over this side. Oops. And take care of them. Take care of them. So so far, Michael, who's on Twitter, I'll be posting you a link to this as well. Mate. Um, I think I'm doing it a little bit better than yourself. I need a little bit because I have no idea. I'm not sure even sure if you've got like a Bible ending in this or whether it's just like typical uh, go for the kills, highest round, etc. I wonder if this poster does anything. No. Okay, let's get double tap while we're here. Got pack a punch. Uh, let's get some ammo. I haven't thrown any um, monkey bombs yet. So my, my thing is, if we stay here, we might be able to just simply take care of these guys. Yep, like that. Do this window up. A couple of grenades over there. Well, they're probably just going nowhere, so we can throw them here. Oh, let's throw a monkey, shall we? Since we've got a max ammo. Did that just go out of the map? I think it did. I think it just ran out of the map. I think it did. I, probably my mistake. But I think we. Oh, look at the zombies blow up. That is freaking awesome. Freaking awesome. So anyway, Black Ops 3, not long now. I mean, you'd be on your summer breaks. And uh, I think, I understand, the beta's still coming out. Planned for PS4 first. No, not Xbox. They lost the um, exclusive, uh, I think the exclusive license to get it released. So now it's Sony's turn. I, I personally don't have an issue with it. The way I look at it is that if we get it first, we may get all the bugs and glitches. If we get it second, there's a high degree they might fix them. Um, which for me is fine. I'm, I'm not a big fan of glitches and bugs and, you know. Um, I remember Advanced Warfare coming out. In the main room, we you go on a um, table, uh, you could just climb on. The zombies didn't touch you. And uh, you could just basically get kills after kills after kills and it it just makes the game a bit boring in my opinion 
Just my just my view. Oh, look at that. Because that could be handy. That could be very handy. Nice nice points builder. Right. Now well then, can we train? Can we train the zombies around the room? Let's have a look. I hope we can. I'm sure we can. Because they are Nazi zombies. So if we can train them up here. Oh, just got hit once, but that's okay. Let's go around here. And if I can try and move just a bit, we might be able to splatter the lot. And we have, there we are. Look at that. Look for a monkey. That's it. Monkey's there. Throw a couple of grenades. Take care of them. Just build the points. There we are. Look at that lot. Round 11 already. I'm not even pack a punch my gun. No, I promise I will actually start looking around the map just to see if there is anything that we're expecting. So far, it's it's not a bad little map. It reminds me of the one room challenge, but I mean that was absolutely insanely difficult. This one, at least you've got the space. Let's just get this barrier done up quickly. And of course, with the PP, it, it's, it makes life quite easy in terms of uh, getting kills. Because it is a good gun. Obviously, but it's better when you've got ammo. I don't have any. Shall I get a grenade? Shall I throw one? Let's see if we can get a crawler. We have. And we've got. Let's get him. Right. So, let's just see. So, nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. Just a window to do up. Get PhD, I guess we've got nothing to lose. And we'll get stamina up as well. Uh, and we're going to get dead shot. Uh, I don't think we need mule kick, to be honest with you. I think we've done quite quite well with just the um So the PPFG 42 we've had the Magnum and of course we've got the monkeys. Oh, look at that. Look at the speed at me. Whoa. Whoa. Maybe I didn't need it. Maybe I did not need it. I hope that's not my downfall. Because that would not be good. I'm going to try and find another challenging map, I think. I think I would like to uh, find something else that we could uh, try out as well. Um, and I will try and get round to doing a multiplayer as well. I keep saying this, but it, it just doesn't happen. It's just not happening at all at the moment. Just another monkey. I've got them. There we are. Take care of them. And that's the done. So I will do a multiplayer map. Um, I'll, I'll probably go on to zombie modding again and just see if we can. Uh, I was going to pack a punch my gun. I thought, no, I won't bother. Because it would be good to try uh, a multiplayer map with um, uh, other players that are, you know, just as enthusiastic as myself. But you know, if they don't want it, to, uh, don't do a YouTube channel. It'd be nice to try it. At least try one map. That's it. Got you. Got you. Got you. I suppose really with these custom maps it's, you know, the limit is your imagination. So, uh, there's whatever you design, it can be played. Even if he's on the moon. As, as we already know. Right, should we pack a punch this? Let's pack a punch. 
And I might do the PP as well. So how many monkeys have we got now? Have I got one? I think it's one. So I need to let's take care of these. Whoa! Oh, I didn't realise it was this, this awesome pack a punch. I bought some time. Oh, no max ammo. I just picked up another max ammo. There's loads of drops in this map. Loads of them. Absolutely lots. We're not complaining. Don't even know. I don't believe there's a viable ending in this. From the looks of it, anyway. I haven't seen anything that, that's proven otherwise. It's just me in a room, with two open windows, all the perks that you would need, and power. So, definitely nothing up here. Right. Oh, yes. It's even better as well. Sometimes you can't see what the hell's going on. All they've got are just colours of the bullets. Let's get the Make sure I don't get hit. That's something else as well I've realised on. You kaboon them, but they still come through the window at an alarming rate. I should be grateful they're not for up zombies, I suppose. Otherwise, uh, my stamina would be used or pushed to the limit. What are we on now? Round 17? Not bad. Not bad. I mean, it's a relatively straightforward map. Nothing too complex in here. You've, you've got all the uh, the tools that you need to win. Uh, unless there's, a, I don't see a viable ending on this, so uh, hopefully I'm not wrong. But with the right guns, the right strategy. I don't know if there's any other laser guns. Mark two laser gun. Find out. Sure. Might might go to the box. Oh, look at that. That was handy. I was just going to throw a monkey and I thought, oh, I might not need to. But I'm going to throw one anyway. There we are. Just creep them up. Nice. Yet again, well, round 18. Uh, we're okay for ammo. I was going to go back to doing carrier on um, advanced warfare, but I've been having so much fun with these, I I've just not seen the need to go back to it yet. My, my bad, yes, probably is my bad. But uh, these have just been so much, so much fun. I think it's just the, the instant variety. Um, obviously some of the different perks, the locations, the guns as well. Some of the guns that you get, they're all so handy. It's uh, just just a good little, good little uh, set of people, a good community of people that uh, go out their way to make maps. Um, as I keep, I always say, credit where credit's due because if they didn't create the map, so I wouldn't be here today playing. I'll leave that for a minute. Oh, I just realised that um, my ammo's going to run out on that, on the uh, 420. Uh, let's get the kaboom. Gets us through the rounds quicker. It's not, not, it's not necessarily about the, the kills at the moment. Just uh, see how far we can get. 
think I did get a quick revive. Yeah, I did. What I don't know is whether the quick revive works as uh, like a Black Ops quick revive or whether it's a World at War version. Well, hopefully I'm obviously wasting my money. I throw my keys. Yep. Hold on over here. Oh. And throw some over there. Oh, they're becoming crawlers now, aren't they? Oh, I don't want that yet. No, I'll hang on to that. But well, we got a max ammo. I could try the box. Should we try the box? Hey, mm, no. I'm just going to throw a monkey over there. Let's do this window up. And throw a couple of grenades. Okay, buys, buys me some time to kill zombies and we got a double point which is double the fun, double the kill, double the kill. I'm actually looking forward completely unrelated to zombies uh, The Force Awakens um, which comes out in December in the UK uh, and also, um, I would like to go and see Terminator Genesis. Um, I've deliberately avoided all the reviews. I've no idea if it's going to work. From what I understand, it's uh, that's like the past and the future has all changed. Um, and Arnold is back, but he's back is a is an older Terminator. Um, so there seems to be a lot of time travel involved and it's that time travel that seems to have screwed up history uh, but as I said I've reserved judgment I'm, I've seen a couple of trailers uh, but nothing more than that so um, I will make some time to go and see that just uh, hopefully they've got a 3D version I hope they've got 3D it would be nice to see it in 3D whoops I must got caught them over here. So yes, uh, but what is it like? I don't know. Right. At the time of doing this uh, video, I have no clue. Uh, I haven't seen any reports. Um, I know Terminator Salvation was, was a bit of a mess. Oh, sugar, sugar, sugar. I can't believe that. They came through. They came through. Let's go and get my points. There we are. So yeah, so Terminator, Terminator Salvation really wasn't that good. Um, and it certainly wasn't seeing it. Worth seeing it just for Arnie as the CGI. But I know they've um, got Arnie back in, involved with, like, I think they've um, made done a CGI mock up of him from the 1984 version of Terminator. So, uh, as I said, it's all time travel stuff, and uh, it, I would say it's confusing, but I've been a serious fan of the Terminator 1 and 2 movie. I mean, Terminator 2 is great, it's one of my favorite films that, that I've ever seen in terms of a sci-fi uh, film uh, I mean it was just all perfect I, s I went to a premiere of it um, so I saw the premiere of that film and and it really really was good it was well worth watching um, and even today it's, it's still worth watching it's, it's a very very good film I also have a box a special tin version of um, oh look I'm out of ammo I've got a tin version of the uh, uh, Terminator 2 movie, it's like a special edition, and um, that's quite nice. Oh, max ammo. I threw a monkey by mistake, I should have thrown a grenade. But can I throw a monkey out here? Does it work? Does the monkey work? 
It does. It does. The monkeys. The monkey does help. Let's take care of these guys. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. The zombie apocalypse is coming to an end. We will defeat these zombies no matter what. Actually, I'm glad I've got the stamina up because it does help in terms of training. Just ever so slightly. Let's group them over there. And let's get the um, PP out and pee all over them. And not fussed about, not too fussed about points. But we're gonna get the kaboom! Oh, oh no 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 no! Don't go down. There you go. Maybe to make this game harder, the PP shouldn't be on the wall. Perhaps it should be just a box gun. Just, just a, an observation from from playing this game. I mean, because this has been my main weapon throughout this uh, this game. I haven't even tried going for a. Um, I haven't even tried using the box yet. Have I? Not to, you know, it's in. Constantly looking for something amazing. Get the Thompson, I guess. But I'd have to pack a punch it now. Just pack a punch it. I'm sure it'll be fun. Let's try it. Yep. Nice. Epic. So Terminator 3, uh, also there's a Marvel film called Ant-Man due out, is that the summer holidays I think? That's due at some point, um, I'm not too sure about that one myself, but um, I wasn't keen on Guardians of the Galaxy at first, but I went to saw it and I changed my mind, it was a very very good film, well worth a watch. And of course they're making a sequel, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 now. So uh, I think that's coming out, that must be due out in 2000, where are we now, 2015, 2017 because I, I happen to know that the um, Marvel Avengers Infinity War, um, it's like a two part film, that's due, oops, oops. Sugar, 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 sugar. That's not good. I got hit when I didn't even realise I was going to go down. Oh no, 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 no. Ah, sugar. Ah, oh, damn it. Well, if I wasn't talking, I probably could have gone on further. But for a first go, uh, round 24, I thought that was okay. Using mostly the PP. Um, but uh, that was quite a good map. Um, no problems with it at all, very easy to get into. Thanks for watching and hopefully I'll see you on the very next video coming up very soon. Ooh, yeah, yeah.